Pack and Meredith. And guys, want you to know we have just officially named you co-captains of our winter meetings coverage, but unfortunately that ends tomorrow. But at least for the night, you're co-captains. Short-lived, but hey, we appreciate <laughs> anything we can get over here in San Diego. But, you know, talking about Aaron Judge and whether or not he will be named captain, it really seems like it's not if but when. In speaking to Hal Steinbrenner early this offseason, he's clearly open to it. Anthony Rizzo this postseason already called Aaron Judge the captain. That is the way he is viewed. And when I look at this, $360 million is an awful, awful lot of money. But there were reports that San Diego was mm. putting a four in front of it. He did leave a little bit of money on the table. He wanted to be a New York Yankee. He wanted to wear pinstripes. And his legacy in pinstripes is important to him. Yeah, I think Aaron Judge has exhibited that it means a lot to him. Obviously, this was a business decision, too. The salary means a lot. But, Meredith, you have had conversations with him. I have had conversations with him. He understands what it means to be a Yankee. And when your general manager is giving interviews and mentioning Cooperstown, I mean, that's what you're talking about right now with Aaron Judge. And you're talking about Monument Park, and everyone has talked about a captaincy. He has 220 homers in his first 729 Major League games. He's got a nine-year contract. If he averages 31 homers a year, he gets to 500. So that's another hallowed mark. I think this was the right move. Even if you're not a Yankee fan, I think him staying in pinstripes just feels like that's where the story was supposed to go. It really does. He is the face of the Yankees. And you look at this upcoming season, 2023, he's going to be 31 heading into that season. We know when he is on the field, he is one of the best players, if not at times the best player in baseball. We saw that during the home run chase. So how does he stay on the field? Well, we talk a lot of numbers around Aaron Judge. Tonight, we're throwing around 360 million. During the season, we threw out 62. Here's the number that I think was most important to Aaron Judge in 2022, 157. He played in 157 games. Meredith, I think if he stays on the field and figures out a way to stay on the field, the numbers will come after that. He actually played in 148 games in 2021. So he's played in 94% of the Yankees games in the last two seasons. He is a talented player. We know he has that mammoth 282-pound body. But I think the Yankees have done a nice job of giving him days off and making sure when the moment is the most important, he's ready to play. It is definitely clear that the Yankees have a plan in how they manage Aaron Judge, and it should be fun to watch over the next nine seasons. Bob, back to you.